वेलकम टू दिस डेली डोज वीडियो ऑन डेवलपमेंट लेंथ ओके सो डेवलपमेंट लेंथ फॉर्मूला वी नो व्हाट इज दैट डेवलपमेंट लेंथ एल डी इज इक्वल टू द स्ट्रेस इन स्टील दैट इज पॉइंट एट सेवन एफ वाई यस इन टू फाइव विच इज द डायमीटर ऑफ द बार डिवाइडेड बाई फोर टाउ बी डी यस दिस इज द इक्वेशन राइट दिस इज द इक्वेशन Now the thing is that this equation is not valid for all the types of bar. Yes, this is only valid for mild steel in tension. It is only valid for mild steel in tension. Okay. Now what are the changes? The changes are when the steel changes from mild to H by S T. Okay, that is high yield strength deformed bar. Then the tau B D increases by how much? 60 percent. There is 60 percent increase in your bond stress tau B D. Yes. And then when the force changes from tension to compression, when the force changes from tension to compression, then also what happens? Then also there is increase of stress of how much? 25 percent. Right? 25 percent. So I can say that since the bond stress is increasing. Okay, in these two cases, I cannot apply this equation for all the cases. So what I will do, I'll make this four as k. I'll write down this as k, and I will change the k h per different conditions. How? Let us see. So if it is mild steel and tension, the force is tension, then the k will remain the original one. That is how much? Four. Okay. Now what happens when it remains mild? But the force changes from tension to compression. Then I have to increase by how much percent? Twenty-five percent, right? You see, from tension to compression, twenty-five percent. So what I will do with this four? I will multiply one point two five. I get how much? Five. So I'll use now what? K is equal to five. Now you see here what happened. Steel changed from mild to H Y S T. Force remained same as tension. So what will happen? Mild to H Y S D, there will be increase of how much? Increase of your sixty percent. So four into one point six Y increase of sixty percent. So my one point six. This gives me how much? Six point four, right? And then you see here, when I'm taking H Y S D bar in compression, what will happen? From mild to H Y S D, there is increase of how much? Sixty percent, right? And from tension to compression, there is increase of 1.25 percent. So this makes it how much? Eight. So what I will do? I will keep the equation of L D as 0.87 F Y phi by k tau B D. Okay. Use this same equation for all the conditions, and then vary this k h per the given condition. If it is mild and tension four, mild and compression five, H Y S D and tension 6.4, and H Y S D and compression eight. Understood? Now I've given this question. Okay, read this question and see that which value of k is applicable here, and give me the development length h per this formula. Okay? So see this question and solve and mention the answer in the comment section. Thank you very much.